Hello, how to solve for x and y in this equation, x squared minus y squared is equal to 16, where x and y are member of natural number solution. Here we have x squared minus y squared is equal to 16. Take note of this that if you have a squared minus b squared, this is equal to a plus b bracket a minus b. Then here where a is equal to x and b equal to y. This can be written as s plus y bracket s minus y is equal to 16. And from here, s plus y is greater than s minus y. Then therefore, this s plus y is greater than s minus y is equal to 16. So we need to look for the product of 16. 16 is a product of 16 multiplied by 1, then 1 multiplied by 16, then we have 8 multiplied by 2, 2 multiplied by 8, and then 4 multiplied by 4. Now here we said s plus y is greater than s minus y, then 16 is greater than 1, this is accepted. 1 is less than 16, this is rejected. 8 is greater than 2, this is accepted. 2 is less than 8, this is rejected. And 4 is equal to 4, this is rejected. So we have how many cases? 1 and 2. Now let's consider the first case. From first case, we have S plus Y bracket s minus y is equal to 16 multiplied by 1 now s plus y is equal to 16 this is equation 1 and s minus y is equal to 1 this is equation 2 we've just formed a simultaneous equation now let's consider the second case second case we have s plus y bracket s minus y is equal to 8 multiplied by 2. Now s plus y is equal to 8. This is equation 1. And then x minus y is equal to 2. This is equation 2. This is also a simultaneous equation. Let's solve this simultaneous equation using elimination method. That is from both first and second case. From first case, we have the equation s plus y is equal to 16 s minus y is equal to 1. We can solve this using the elimination method by adding the two equations together. If you add the two equations, we have x plus s. This is 2x plus y minus y. This we cancel this. Then equal to 16 plus 1. That is 17. Now let's divide both sides by 2. Divided by 2 because we are looking for the value of x. This we cancel this. Now, S is equal to 17 over 2. And of course, 17 over 2 is not a natural number. So, this is rejected. Not a natural It is rejected.
Now let's solve for y since we've got the value of x using either equation 1 or equation 2, but I'm going to make use of this equation 2. To solve for y, we have x minus y is equal to 1 when s is 17 over 2. Here we have 17 over 2 minus y is equal to 1. Then let's multiply all through by 2. We have 17 minus 2y is equal to 2. Minus 2y is equal to 2 minus 17. Minus 2y is equal to minus 15. Then y is equal to 15 over 2. This is not a natural number. It is also rejected. Now, let's consider the second case. From the second case, we have x plus y is equal to 8. Then, x minus y is equal to 2. Let's solve this. You see elimination method. Then s plus s. This is 2s plus y minus y. This will cancel out. 8 plus 2. This is equal to 10. We cannot divide both sides by 2. Divided by 2. This will cancel this. 2 here 1. 2 in 10. That is 5. Therefore, s is equal to 5 and of course this is a natural number it is accepted now we've got in the value of s let's solve for y to solve for y let me make use of this equation one that is s plus y equal to 8 when s is equal to 5 we have 5 plus y is equal to 8 then y is equal to 8 minus 5 y is equal to 3 and this is also a natural number it is accepted Therefore, our final answer is huh? S, comma, Y is equal to 5, comma, 3. This is the final answer. We can check to confirm if this answer is right or wrong. Let's check. To check, we have the given equation. S square minus Y square is equal to 16. Then S is 5. We have 5 square minus y is 3. That is 3 square must be equal to 16. 5 square, this is 25. Minus 3 square, that is 9, must be equal to 16. And of course, 25 minus 9, this is 16, is equal to 16, which is true. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Bye.